Hi everyone, this is Sharp, testing subscription razor blades for you so you can pick the right one. So today, we've got an exciting one up for trial. This is Gillette. So I've been watching the Gillette site for ages and uh, finally they've entered the subscription market. It's been a long time coming. So they've got three options available. This one is the Mark III. So I thought I'd start with that, given that I've been um, testing some of the three blades recently. So this is a very simple razor blade. It's a three blade with a pivoting head. And um, yeah, there's not a lot to be said to it. It's got no back razor there or anything like that. It's a very simple three blade. So I'm gonna swap out for a new blade. I've been testing it for the last couple of weeks and just with a single blade, oh, just put this new one in and then get lathered up. So just as a reminder, using a standard uh, Geo Trumpers shaving foam, shaving cream, just so that we've got a norm across the board. So I'm actually uh, almost running out down to my last little bit of Trumpers there. So I must say I was quite looking forward to testing the Gillette, given that they've taken so long to catch up with everybody else and get a subscription out into the market. They've basically just done a subscription for their current kind of supermarket models, which is pretty boring. Uh, you think they would have done something a bit more interesting. They could have come up with a specific subscription model, which might have been interesting. Anyway, we're not talking about marketing, we're not talking about packaging, we're talking about the shave. So here we go. We've got a couple of days growth on here, and uh, my first thoughts when I picked this three up and gave it a go on the first day was that it seems to slide through well, seemed to be a nice smooth shave, and I thought we'd got the same kind of uh, closeness coming on as maybe the bulking or maybe clean shaven which I tested last time however I soon realized that I was actually going to be disappointed so overall really not that impressed with this at all and I'll tell you why basically the head too floppy so you can't get any purchase it's quite similar to the cornerstone in that regard which I tested very early on so the cornerstone had a similar issue in that it kept uh, you just couldn't couldn't get the angle and couldn't get the purchase that you wanted so this is similar it just doesn't seem to just doesn't seem to give you what you need uh, no matter how hard you push you've still <laughs> got stubble there so this is a three day growth with an opportunity to really take it off down but you'll see there, I don't know if you can see that, but it just won't, will not take that bit off there, which is particularly annoying. So if I compare this three blade to, for example, the three blade clean shaven uh, that I tested a week or so ago, like that was a much better blade. The angle of the blades was better. The cut was so much closer. Mm. This feels like you're shaving with a five blade. Feels like the angle's all wrong. And pretty disappointing. So there we have it. I'll finish off. I might go back over with my Bold King in a minute. But first up of the Gillettes, the Gillette Mark III. Three blade, very floppy, no real purchase not a clean shave so um yeah that one's going down near the bottom of the list thanks for catching up this is sharp we'll be doing some more soon cheers for now bye